Okay, we got a clay block here. Very dense. Uh, really wet stuff. We're going to shoot it with a 50 caliber. But first, we're going to throw some 22s in it. We also got uh, value size shaving cream. We got regular sensitive skin. I also got uh, some other stuff. It, it, you know, you don't want to stick with just generic. You want to make sure you get the real stuff. So anyways, we're going to shoot some shaving cream. We got some other little doodads. We got a dueling tree. I'm going to put the camera right here by the block so you guys see a good view. It looks like it went in and it's just like, you it took off. Okay, we're sorry you missed it because the camera actually shut off during the firing of the 50 caliber into a clay block. Now the clay block, it turned into like paper. It, uh, there's just a bunch of these sheets of clay everywhere. Uh, I didn't think it would do that. Well, I knew it would blow it up, but I didn't think it would turn it into sheets of paper. It's just, uh, <laughs> did you think it would turn it into sheets of paper? I just thought it would be chunks. Maybe, oh, geez. there is the entry of the 50 caliber bullet. What grain was that? What? What grain were you firing? Uh, 668, I think. 668? Well, I, obviously I didn't need the towel on the bench because it is completely cleared off. I thought it would make a, a lot more mess. Alright, so we want to do the shaving cream cans. I don't even think you'd have to hit them. I think just to going next to them, because it blew the camera off, it turned the camera off. <laughs> Just by the uh, shockwave, and the camera was it was uh, actually quite a ways away from the clay block, about three or four feet. So I'm gonna try the shaving cream here, and then our good camera, the battery died, and it's because I stupidly left it on. This is a Safety Harbor Firearms. So it set you back quite a bit. It's not, obviously uh, you're not paying. The rifle's about uh, 2100 in the end. 2100. Then I have a uh, Truchicon X point uh, 520 by 50 scope on there. That was a grand. So I have a little over a grand and stuff. A uh, M60 bipod. I paid uh, 125 bucks for it. And that's because the guy didn't know what he had, huh? Yeah. <clears throat> what kind of brake is that? Shark brake. I like that. Man, I tell you what, when you fired it the first time, I felt it clear back here, so it does pulse. Ready? Oh, yeah. Jesus Christ! Fuck! That thing blows some serious air. It almost flipped me over. Uh, I don't think there's a survivor. It's just mayhem everywhere. It smells good though. It does smell good, don't it? What the, it smells like a morning shave, first thing in the morning. Ah. Boy, look at that streak all the way up. Blech. <laughs> Looked like I had a blowout on the toilet or something. Blech. And, and you, missed, you missed the rack. Oh, maybe. There is shrap metal. Wow, look at that. that. That reminds me of a scene from Ghostbusters when they kill a marshmallow man. <laughs> Just a uh, part of a can. In there, that can looks like somebody stepped on it. It's all crushed in. Strange. 
That was nasty. Come on. You keep going, uh, keep going up to the left. There you go. Yeah, my sights are way off, dude. Yeah, I saw that. You kept shooting the left. You were right on for, uh, height. I saw them bullets flying off of there. I'll go for the far left. We'll work right in the middle. Alright. Whoa, shit, I can't see. Where'd it go? Hey, smell that thing. Man, I'm running two goals. God damn it. Oh no, you cut the little fucker. It's always the worst sound, isn't it? Quick. Ah, so stuck it. He's running. <laughs> Did it rotate? No. I did it! You're screwed, man. I got the top. Oh, they're coming your way. 